I'm excited about my new book, Limitless Thinking, Limitless Living, and I just want to tell you the story of how this book came about. In my prayer time, God began to speak to me, and he said, Danette, you are thinking way too small. And then I started praying, and I was like, okay, and I was reading the word. And then about a month later, the Lord says, you're expecting way too small. Then I was at a large national Christian gathering and a national prophet called me out and said, you right there on the front row, God says that you're thinking too small and you're believing way too small. God wants you to believe big. And he went on and elaborated. And God began to speak to me, Danette, you've got to think big and you've got to expect big. So limitless thinking opens the door to us stepping into limitless living for the kingdom of God. You know, when we limit God, we are limiting his ability. And so many times what we believe is we believe that God will do it for everybody else, but we need to know that God will do it for us and in us. So we've got to take the limits off. Believe big for what God can do in you, through you, and for you. God wants you to remove all the limits off of your natural mind and what you think. And as we begin to think big, then we can ask God for big. The word says, ask and you shall receive, seek and you shall find, knock and the door shall be open. So we ask big, we think big, we ask big, then we expect big. What are you expecting? Sometimes we just expect God just to do this. We're just expecting just to make it through. No, we need to expect big and then we will see God do big things. God is moving in a way in the earth today that is just, it's supernatural and miracle healings, but also in abundant financial blessings, opening doors, setting people free, doing things that are exceedingly abundantly above all that we could ever think, ask, or imagine. God wants you to remove all self-imposed limitations, and he also wants you to remove all perceived limitations. Maybe you are perceiving that God can't do big things through you because of your education, because of your experience, because of your background, because of your finances. Whatever it is, God wants you to remove those limitations, have limitless thinking and limitless living for the kingdom of God, for the glory of God. I'm excited what God is going to do through this book. I know that this word has blessed me and it's changed my life and my ministry, and I believe that it's going to be life-changing for you as well. God bless.